Well, well, hello guys, it's Donitia, and today we're playing something new. We're playing this visual novel, Stay, Stay, Democratic People's Republic of Korea! Very nice! So, let's skip to the intro! Wait, I mean, uh, you know the game. Okay, shut up. Well, anyway, um, we're... What is my name? What is my name? Do you know what is my name? I don't know what's... I don't know. It's Karol Donitz. Yeah, my name is Karol Donitz. Okay. It's taken a long time, but it's finally going to happen. What's going to happen? I'm finally on a plane from Beijing to Pyongyang. I'll be staying the week with a couple pen pals in the Korean army. Well, that's interesting. I... <laughs> well, nobody expected me to do an anime... Anime game. Oh, no. I'd been writing them while on duty in Afghanistan. Oh, yes, I was fighting the Taliban. Yes, this is my code name, Carl Donnie, this is my code name, my real, is, my, my, my real name is John Wick. And I was fighting in Afghanistan. No, Taliban and the uh, other But let's skip that and let's go. They seemed interested in meeting me. So they asked me to come on, on my next leave. Okay. It didn't look like it was going to happen though. I'm not sure why, but the airport wouldn't let me fly to, to Pyongyang. Something about no direct flights and having to fly to China or Russia first. I only just barely learned Korean in the in time for this. <laughs> then I had to stumble through Chinese to get here, there, there. But we're about to touch down at Pyongyang Sunan International Airport. Uh, was? I spreche nicht Korean. I think he said if you're about to descend, well thank you. <laughs> Once we get off, I'm waiting for my bags at the claim center. Okay. Airline lunch. I was a bit late since I had to use the bathroom. So it looks like they already started unloading. Hmm. Dot dot dot. They stopped the baggage claim carriage. My bags aren't there. Oh man, this is foo bar. Don't tell me they lost my luggage. <laughs> man, you're fucked. No passports in North Korea. Mm -mm, you're going to the gulag. Re-education re re camps. Yes, re-education camps. It's a hard word to say. Turning around, I walk straight into someone. Oh, who is that? Hey! Why are you right behind me? <laughs> Carol Donitz. <laughs> wow. I run right into the what appears to be a member of the Korean military. Full suit and everything. What's more, sh she's hot. <laughs> she's hot, yes. <laughs> okay, she's hot. If you go for the chick in uniform thing, Mr. Carlton, it's I presume. Three question marks. Okay. Is she or? Yes. Her English is pretty good, a bit broken, but better than most kids in. I met in Afghanistan. <laughs> how do you know my name? Yes. How do you my? How do you know my name? We were expecting your arrival. I finally noticed that she's not alone. Another cute girl in the military. Regalia is next to her. But how? I only told my buddy is Jiang and Ju and Ji that I was showing up. That would be us. Now who's speaking? Wait, I thought uh, it's not. I just mean and Jiang and Unji well guys names. Not always, like some names in our country. In your country, they can be applied to both genders. Okay, so you are 
John G, how the fuck do I read these letters? Anyway, John G. I'll I'll be calling you John G now from now. Okay, John G. Uh, okay, I hope you understand. Wait. Uh, skip after just. Uh, skip after just. What is this? What is this? Wait. Um, ah, I see. Extras. Uh, okay. Return. Okay. Okay. The tr tr taller girl smiles politely. Oh, like Francis and Francis. I think I get it. What? Wait a second. You didn't think Carl Donitz was a girl named Stitio? <laughs> I. I hope not. <laughs> I I think that Carol Donitz is a male name. Oh fuck, Koshu Nota. Who would name a Giru Carol Donitz? <laughs> what the fuck? Yunji. Okay, let, okay. Rapid, rapid, okay. Oh fuck, Koshu Nota. Who would name a Giru Carol Donitz? But you you said it was fine if I stayed with you while I was here. Absolutely, we have special permission to have you stay in our personal bags. Well, Gianji and me. Well, we might have a hold up. <coughs> I was correct. Uh, it looks like the airline lost my luggage, so I need to check with the service desk about it. No need to worry, we have set cards here luggage. Mm, well that's nice, John G. That's great, um when is it? Hey, by the way, this game was uh released in year 2017, yes, the good old days. It has been sent to our political barriers priority checkpoint. Oh nice, okay. F wait, what? Fine, fine, what? <laughs> They must make sure you have no illegal contraband on you. Uh, what did I bring with me? I don't know. I hope they won't check my mobile. <laughs> Our phone. It's from South Korea. <laughs> Samsung. Hey, look at it. Look at that pose. Anything that will be a Dutch Retriment to our country and glorious leather will be confiscated. Uh, well, there doesn't seem to be any way to treat it a friend. Uh, if you desire our friendship, then do this. Uh, okay. You can speak Korean, right? Hell no. Well, I've been studying a little. I guess I have a handle on it. I've even got this manual to help me out. Well, that won't work. I reach into my carry-on and pull out my translation guide. Glorious. Okay, ching chang chong ching. Chong chi xiao ta. Chong chi is wang patan. Wang patan, yeah. Don't translate that last sentence, please. Upon seeing it, Yun Chief slaps it out of my hands. Ow! What the hell did you do that for? You taro bring a transaction manual of a Ora Marta enemies into Ora Fuentefuf country? <laughs> How am I supposed to understand it? <laughs> but it's a Korean translation manual. I'm sorry for Yunji's outburst, but the manual depicts the language of the territory occupied by Western imperialists. Imperialists? I didn't think the British ever invaded Korea. Well, my guy, let's check the information. Okay, so Google, what the fuck is this? Uh, oh, well, okay. Um, yes. Did British invade Korea? Yes, they invaded in August 1950 with UN. So that would make them an our enemy. Okay. I thought it was all just one big Korea. I'm so glad you understand the situation. There is only one true Korea. 
Isn't it? Yes. There is just one Korea. Okay. Okay, please stop, stop pointing the finger on me. Like at last, I'd like you. I'd like for you to work with Yunji. Yunji. Mm -hmm. Yunji. She'll help you get better with Korean. Uh, well, I think it will be hard if she can't speak proper English. And you'll help. <laughs> well, that doesn't make any sense, but okay. Jeonji? Yes, that's my face right there, Inji. Dot dot dot. She doesn't appear happy at that arrangement. Uh, she'll get used to it. I hope so. I read in my old translation manual that it's polite to bow to new co-workers. Okay, let's bow. Okay. So I will. I'm standing out from standing out from my chair and bowing to the ladies, right? Well, I mean co-workers. Not the ladies, the... Uh, uh, well, uh, uh, okay, shut up. Uh, I turn to Yonji and Bo. Okay. Thanks for helping me with Korean. Why you thank me? <laughs> Why you thank me? <laughs> Stop. <clears throat> I'm a, I'm a only do this help me better English. It's not like I do this for ya, stupida. Either way, I appreciate it. Why you? I know help you for you to. <laughs> now Yunji, you were so excited about our friend coming to visit. There's no need to be so rude to him. <laughs> I hope we a good English teacher. It's time we, be <laughs> we went back to our barracks. You should be thankful. Like, this is funny, the first intro scene, I have to say, it's funny. Like, yes. <laughs> I like this. The top advisor on tourism recommended you stay with your guides instead of at a hotel. You may bring a lot of foreign cash, though, as we suggested, yes. Uh, I did, though I'm not quite sure I understand why. I couldn't I just use my credit card? You dumb fuck. You can't use a credit card in North Korea. It would be quicker than going to exchange all of these bills for Korean won. Plus, I feel funny having all of these coins on me. Most everything you need has already been paid in for in advance. Or you can use credit card in North Korea. Okay, you, you guys from North Korea Tell me if you use uh, credit cards in North Korea, okay? Jeonji? Most everything you have, okay, I read it. However, the shops you'll visit will want hard currency. And they prefer foreign bills to the bone. Okay, so I'll be paying to, for things in my own currency then? You know reason? It's simple. No one Dora only. <laughs> Jeonji is pretty cute when she's grumpy. Her cheeks get all puffed up. Okay, stop. Uh, this is North Korea. This is not a dating simulator, even if she is hot. I do feel a bit bad for her thought. Uh, uh, what is uh? Um, Unji, would you prefer I just speak Korean? Why you? My English no good for you. <laughs> Maybe it's easier f for now, though. I guess I have to speak Korean from here on out. Oh my god. Xiong Xiong Han Chi. Oh, we should take a picture together before we leave the airport. Um, okay. Uh, my phone. Wait. My phone is with me? Well, I guess. Well, anything. Uh, I get my phone out. Yes, my phone is right here. And take a picture of all of us. Oh no, that's, that's a bad. You can't uh, uh, photo military personnel of North Korea. You to the gulags, to the re-education camps. What? What did you just do? I just took your picture. That's all. No, get rid of it now. But it looks so adorable. See? Stop it! I'm not cute. Get rid of that photo now. 
I don't stand. It's just a picture. I'm sorry, but let me explain. You, you, how can you come to North Korea with no knowing anything, boy? You stupid. Yeah, she she was she told the truth. You're stupid. I'm sorry, but let me explain. In Korea, we do not allow photos of our military to be taken with no permission. Unless it's a national event in which it cannot be helped. I must ask you to please tell it the photograph. Oh, can't I keep it? It was a really good shot. Yunji, look as adorable being the only one so putty. What is your putty? Uh, what's the meaning of putty? Who knows? I showed the photo to Jong who giggles just a little. Oh my god, she changed the personality. He has a point. This is a pretty cute photo. Before I can say anything else, Yunji stomps over me and swipes my phone. Well, I'll save you the trouble. I'll let it myself. I guess Jung forgot we were supposed to be confiscated. We were supposed to confiscate this anyway. But that's my brand new phone. Yes, from South Korea. I mean, Cor uh, nothing. No worries, you'll get it back at the end of your stay. <laughs> okay, thanks. Can I speak in that English? I will put in a call to headquarters to get you a suitable replacement. One that will work on our network. I am pretty sure I saw four bars on my phone. It's best to not argue with her about this one. Uh, I guess it's not worth it. Yes, very true. Please follow us to the car and we will take you to our place. I was surprised I should already have finished checking your luggage. I'll be able to relax. Finally, relaxing with hot ladies. They lead me to large, boxy automobile. It looks like a 1980s a Soviet car, but with some modification to the interior. I sit in the back, and I can't see anything outside. And I can't see it to the front of the vehicle either. Uh, it's kind of dark in here. I was hoping to see some of the city as it draw. Oh no, she's close to me. I'm afraid that since we're taking you to our personal barracks, we can't let you see the route. It is forbidden by our illustrious leader that tourists do not know the way from the airport to the military locations. Uh, I guess that makes sense. You never want your secrets to be out. Okay, then why did they let me stay at your personal barracks? Yes, that doesn't make any sense to. Ow. Sorry. I know, stop questioning. They told us to take you to stay with us and we are doing so. Now, I don't think this is the right plot. Big rate for our place is better than any local hotel. No, nah, I guess. I'm grateful. Thank you for taking me in. Oh, she blushing. I told you, stop thanking me. Yonji. What? Somebody. Uh, uh, nothing. Uh, it's not like we're headed for you or anything. we are just following orders. I swear. I think she blushed saying that. I think someone has a little crunch. What the fuck is crunch on you, girl? Then it's a crunch. A crunch. I never heard somebody say that. A crunch, don't you mean a crush? I'm not sure I get what you just said. Maybe I'm not saying that I No, you're not. Stop that. Let's just listen to the radio. Yes, to the North Korean <laughs> news. He flicks the dial on a very old looking car radio. The first sound I hear is what I can only guess is a Korean guy singing some awful cover. Don't stop me now! Guess I'm having a good time! Don't stop me now! Why am I singing it to? Oh, it is the latest hit. That's a hit! Latest. Yes. We heard that it's very popular. Where? 
Best song, wait, best song, yes, this this makes sense. Best song 2016, the singer should do the tour here. Wow, they really like this song. I think that might be hard for Freddy. Freddy? The original singer of the song. This was a huge hit in 1978. I'm certain you are wrong. Hey, hey, stop spreading American propaganda. You're spreading imperialist propaganda, you can get locked. Okay, you're going to re-education camps. Okay. Uh, this is the third time that you are going to re-education camps. So, yes, you're not getting a lot of out of this country, yes. We have it. We have we have it on good authority that this song was written by the glorious leader himself. Yes, that's true. That's very true. Now, if you say that, we are not going to send you to the re-education camps. Mm, our first decision. So, there is not a third option where I can say that I agree with her. Okay, so insist that the song is quite old or gently tell her the song is quite old. Okay, let's be gentle. Those are women. So gentlemen always wins. I'm sorry, but you weren't given accurate information. If you guys haven't confiscated my MP3 player, I can play the track and show you on here. When I get my luggage back, that is. <gasps> You dot dot dot. Oh, good. We're almost there. And the car is slowing down and turning to what I assume is the person back tricks. I can only guess though, since I can't see outside the car. The silence we had since the radio incident is broken by a sharp noise. It appears Jiang is using junk. Yes, in I mean, you are not Jiangji. George, John is using more Freddie Mercury for his ringtone. For her, not his. Excuse me, I need to take this call. She turns from us and jabs away on her phone. Okay, I figure maybe I should speak to Yunji. Okay, let's teach her our English. So, if I'm staying here, I'm guessing you guys must have extra room. Being a military base, I don't think you to have a lot of extra space. Well, they were just barely facing out those quonsets huts when I was going to a boot camp. Don't stick me in broom closet or something, alright? Don't be so ridiculous, Carl. Dominance. You won't be in a closet. Okay. Are all soldiers in America so dump? No wonder glorious leader says we'll be conquering you soon. <laughs> Did you just imply your country is planning on attacking my country? <laughs> uh, 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 okay, let's let's save this. Okay, thank you. I give her a shocked look. I never heard of Koreans harboring hostile leaders. Why aren't we all... Uh, <laughs> I think you are forgetting where are you. Oh yes, you believe that there is only one Korea? No two. Yes. At some point, all must be Korea. <laughs> yes, all must be Korea. I love the Korea. It is a part of new initiative from our most tight and honorable champion. Champion. Dot, dot, dot. Anyways, it is of no concern to you. Stop asking such silly things. Okay. We want you to enjoy your stay here. You'll see your sleeping quarters soon enough. Wait, I can wait. I'll leave it to you, Yunji. I hear John getting off the phone. Just in time, it's getting pretty awkward in here. Good news! The inspection of your luggage is complete. 
They found that little treasure now, so there should be very little missing. Well, let's kill Mills. Will I get my belongings when I leave back for home? Da -da -da. Hell no. Junk? <laughs> hey, I know you're probably uh, starving, right? Yeah, you want. What are you planning to make for dinner? You can cook. You'll never see this from today. Hey, <laughs> I'm making dinner. I thought we were just taking him to the mess hall. Mess hall? How can we be so thoughtless? He's our guest. He should make a proper meal for him. Uh, it's okay. I don't mind hitting up the Korean Cho Wall. I mean, I'm fine with whatever you two want to do. Uh, you're poking the fun at me, aren't you? Yonji appears angry. Well, even more angry than she had been. You don't think so? You don't think I can do it? You think my English is terrible and I can't even cook? That, that's not what I'm to say. I'll show you. One home cooked meal coming up. Well, I appreciate it. I'll make you eat your words and some kimchi. Kimchi? That is so sweet of you, Yonji. You must really like her. <laughs> you must really like her. It's you haven't cooked anything in many months. Not since the time you burned the soba noodles. Oh no, soba noodles. You always bring that up. Stop embarrassing me. I'm just glad you're cooking again. Looks like our is already having a crazy flint on you. Before you and she can respond, there's a knock on our door. Jiong opens it to see the driver standing there. We have arrived. Please, show the capitalist. <laughs> Please, show the capitalist to his quarters. Yes, Mr. Capitalist right here. <laughs> Thank you. Well, we're here. Let's head in. Crunch. Crunch. What the fuck is crunch? <laughs> I let out a small stretch after the long journey. John grabs my hand and starts sliding me to the room before me. She looks cute even more for so for a soldier. But she definitely has strong grip. I mean, it's not like we don't have a woman on base, but uh, none of them look like her. Jeez, I've got to stop thinking like that. It's just a vacation, don't make it weird. <laughs> yes, stop making it weird, Carol. Are you okay, Carol Donitz? What? Yes, 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 I'm fine, thank you very much. But your face was so red, I thought you might have caught a fever. Oh no, it was just, um. Jung puts her hand to my forehead, her hand is so sore. Yeah, she's definitely not infantry. I have a bit of a manner, so I saw infantry. I still have nightmares. The nightmares. <coughs> Jung is so pretty though. You're so hot. And you're sweating a little. Are you sure you're okay? I'm sure, I'm sure, really. I'm just uh, tired from the flight. Yeah, that's it. i uh, tired from the flight. Thank goodness, I was worried. The stores have been out of... What is that? Lebofrofen? For a few days now. Lebofrofen. I'm not sure how we could have treated the fever. Uh, 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 oh no, he's breeding capitalist fever. We can't allow that. They're going to re-education camps. Oh my god, we're going to the fourth, uh, fourth time there. Yunji, hey! When you two are done, could you help with the tap? It is stuck again, Jung. Uh, let me take care of that for you. This faucet has definitely seen better days. It looks like some of it has started to rest pretty badly. Hopefully, the water is clean and safe to drink. Of course it is, it is water. 
Magic cards always hit the guys at the bottom first, I guess. That you're not at the bottom. It takes some effort, but after a few tries, water manages to come out. <coughs> I could have done it quicker myself. Okay, UNG. <laughs> they show me around. They are private quarters. Oh. It's not too bad. A couple of bedrooms, a common room, kitchen, and a bath. Yonji. <gasps> I need to finish preparing the dinners for tonight. Jong, I'll show you to your room. Again, Jong grabs me by the hand and leads me to my room. North Korea! The Kim Jong un MPA. Wait, yes. The bedroom has sand amounts of decoration. And the windows are small, but do let some light in. On the bed is my suitcase, unharmed by the search and seizure ordeal. Uh, hello, Jong. This will be your room for the week. I'll be staying in the other bedroom with Yunji. I hope you find the room to your liking. Wait, are you telling me this is your normal room? Yes, but you didn't needed a place to sleep. I don't mind staying in Yunji's room for a week. We can think of it like what your American teenage teenaged teen what how do you pronounce that? Teenaged Yes, American teenaged girls say A sleepover mm. I can see Yuji's bedroom across the hall. There's just one bed, and it's book enough for both of them. I can't put you out of your room and have you sleep on the floor. Do you have a sleeping bag or some extra blankets? I can go sleep on the floor in the common room. That is not needed. You are our guest. Everybody is honorable to have you sleep on the floor. Make yourself at home. We should have a dinner ready soon. She smiles and walks out the door, leaving me in the room. I open my suitcase. Everything I had neatly folded has been tossed around and crumpled up. Of course, I can actually blame the Koreans for that. After all, I went through a couple different airports, including the one with TSA security back in the States. Hell, the TSA broke my computer the last time I tried to fly. Oh my god, TSA. It looked like they took a hammer to my motherboard, the MTSA. Eh, I made it to see my comfy Tokyo Hotel t-shirt is still in here. <gasps> Imperialist propaganda! Tokyo! I slip out of my traveling clothes and toss that on with a pair of... Oh, hell no! <laughs> We're sending you to the re-education camps for the fifth time, bro! Jeans? Jeans are viewed as American propaganda! How dare you! <laughs> How dare you, boy! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> if you're going to be sent it for the sixth time to the free education camps, I'm ending this video. For sure! Not too long after, I smell something fairly decent coming from the kitchen. I decide to head there. No, no, with the jeans. And see if I can help. Not with the jeans. <laughs> Both girls are there. Jung has changed into more comfortable attire. But Yonji is still dressed in a military uniform. Jung must have heard me walking as she turns to greet me. Ah, ah. Hi, Carolyn. Dinner isn't quite ready yet. Uh, that's okay. I thought I might be able to help. I don't need help from Western capitalists who don't know true Korean food. As she says this, she turns to face me, and a shocked look crosses her face. <gasps> what do you think you're doing? You can't fear that in Korea. You'd be shot on the sight. Yes, get those jeans out. Not with the jeans. Shot for wearing of your jeans. The tragedy. No, 
for advertising an attraction of an enemy state. Chong doesn't seem too pleased either. Wait, you mean the t-shirt? Fool, of course we meant the t-shirt. What were you thinking advertising a hotel from Japan here in Korea? Oh my god, I forgot about the hotel. But it's not... Are you one of those... Those idiots who think all our countries are the same? Okay bro, you're going to be sent it for the seventh, sixth time to the area education camp. Okay guys, I'm ending this here, right here. And I'll see, be seeing you in the next part. Okay, six times in a re-education camp. This man at the end of the story, he's not going to survive this. He's not. He, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Okay, anyway guys, I'll be seeing you uh, t tomorrow maybe. Okay, I don't know. Well, whenever. Okay, so bye bye guys. See ya, love you and everything. Like, comment, share video with your friends. And that's all. Thank you. Bye-bye.